headed here at about quarter after nine. It was at, I had to go to Tim's. There's not a Robin's Coffee nearby. It, it's hot. It was hot when we arrived yesterday. And it's going to be a hot one today. And I think it's going to be in the upper 20s for the rest of the week. But chances of thunder showers. I'll have to check that chances of thunder showers. Um, Turn right onto Route 119. Yes. Gotta pay attention because they're these aren't so obvious. Thank God I have maps on my phone because my um, in 5.8 kilometers, turn left onto Sea Cow Head Road. My Ford uh, display thing, Cacto.
Good morning. Well, I thought rather than the, the usual intro from the boring inside the car, I'll sit out here and get eaten by mosquitoes and give you a bit more of a view. I think that's called Indian Head Lighthouse. I'll correct that if I'm wrong. Um, it's, it's truly amazing. I'm on PEI, so this is my first full day of touring. It's a small island, but we're going to try and be a little strategic. Um, as I mentioned before, I'm not into the touristy, touristy stuff, but um, I do like to see the out of the way stuff like these lighthouses and whatnot. I'm not obviously by the roads, nice and red. They're not in the greatest of conditions. So. Van's going to be red by the time I'm done and in the need of a car wash. So that being said, there's people out fishing. Summerside is just across the way. And it's just an absolutely gorgeous day. We've been on the road now for about an hour and a half. This is our second lighthouse stop. We really haven't gone that far. It's all part of that touristy thing that goes on, right? So I'm gonna let you go stay tuned, folks. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. I'm almost at the 100 uh, subscribers. And my one video is to starting to, we're over 3K now, so that's great. And so hopefully, I think I'm done with uh, Newfoundland for videos. I do have some short ones that I will do later. That's, I think it's going to be a winter project. I'm trying to do the key stuff for now. And uh, yeah, so stay tuned and see what's coming up next, because this is one beautiful province.